Kelly, what do you think about Kim Kardashian? Well, she's a hot batch. I'm actually into Gigi from the Shaza Sunset right now. This batch's catchphrase is, charge it to my daddy. I wish I could charge it to my daddy. If I ever charged anything to my dad, he would charge me with assault. I once charged a pair of shoes to my dad's credit card and he was all, what's up? And then he made me clean the downstairs toilet for an hour. That's where he reads the newspaper. For an hour. Ew. Duck. I've butt slapped my dad across the face. It doesn't hurt him as much as when I use his credit card. Kelly, what is your fave work of Shakespeare, Betch? My English teacher made us all read Romeo and Juliet, and I was all, if only they had cell phones. Then she could be like, um, by the way, Romeo, I'm gonna fake my own death. So just pick me up at the cemetery. And he'd be all, okay, I'll see you later. Love you. That'd be great, Romeo. That way we could have a relationship for another six months or so. That's how these things usually go. It's like when you watch an old 80s movie and they're all, I have to get to a payphone. And you're like, you do? Oh yeah, I guess you do. My English teacher also made us read Othello. And that was a story about jealousy and how it can destroy your life if you believe in rumors. So it's kind of like Pretty Little Liars, but with dudes and sword fights. Siri, was Shakespeare, what was Shakespeare? What's going on, Batch? I don't understand. Don't ask Siri. Who was Shakespeare? What's this, Wikipedia? I found this for you. This is a spreadsheet. You suck. Kelly, would you consider using words like feck, cent, s, ers, pesse, betch? If you don't know what words they really are, here's a translation. F, star, k, s, star, t, star, s, star, ers, p, star, s. Are you fucking kidding me? The difference between a hippie and a hipster is irony. So if you're a hippie, just add irony, maybe a hat, and that's a hipster.